No. Osti. Osti got. Who gets the honors? Valentina, nice knowing you. Welcome back to KSP Hardcore with Tabernoosh. Time to put the first Kerbal in space. The first Kerbal in space. Without a command pod. Here we go. So, we've got a rocket that we know can get to space. Can achieve orbit for that matter. But, there's nowhere on it for a Kerbal. So, let's address that. First, we take off, Mr. Goo, take off the parachute. I think someone can sit right there? I think so. Oh yeah, this looks extremely safe. We're gonna need those parachutes back. So, look at our structural options. Mini I beams, two of them. concern here is that our pilot's going to get blown off by aerodynamic, aerodynamic forces while we're, while we're taking off. So let's see. Aerodynamics. Aerodynamic nose cone. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Think we can fit a Kerbal in there? I think we can fit a Kerbal in there. Let's put a mystery goo back on. Just one. Just one. Here. I think we're gonna need a battery. are clipped when they don't need to be. Yes. Slide. Speak <laughs> after saying I don't like things clipped when things are clipped when they don't need to be. I'm actually gonna clip the battery. No, that doesn't help at all. I was trying to get a little bit more room for the nose cone. I don't I want to make sure that our Kerbal actually fits in there without sticking its head out. Okay, this will go to space. We do not really have an abort system though. If this goes wrong, I think we're losing Kerbal. Hmm. Actually, that makes me wonder. What if, what if? <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is absolutely ridiculous. And 
then, if we can blow this off and the whole thing doesn't explode, our Kerbal can jump out. Okay, we're over our part limit by two parts. So we're gonna have to take off. Uh, Fins, anyways. Let's go. Osti. Osti got. Who gets the honors? Valentina, nice knowing you. We didn't check our staging. I want to make sure our nose cone doesn't get blown off early. We'll put it up there with the parachutes. Everything else looks good. Check yo staging. I've got science to perform already. Is it a crew report? EVA report. Okay, we've got to point our camera up here so we can actually see what's going on with Val. EVA report. Transmit. All right. What a beautiful day to make history. You ready, Val? Oh, stoic. Oh, put your helmet on. God damn it. Are you insane? Is your head sticking out through the top? No, perfect. All right, enough stalling. We have liftoff. Straight up, no complications. Beautiful. I'm gonna reduce the thrust a little bit so that when we stage, we don't fly completely out of control. How you doing it there, Val? Ah! <laughs> Looks a little worried. Nothing to worry about, Val. Entirely under control. We're making history here. Strap to the top of a ballistic missile. Stage. Oh yeah, total stability. Crew at least one. I'll do about 70,000. We're gonna make this. For sure. I'm actually tempted to tilt a little bit to the west, away from the water. We've got two parachutes, I'm feeling good about our ability to land. We might as well try and land in a new biome and get some science. Like those well, may not be mountains, it's a bit dangerous. But let's hit space before we uh before we tip over too much. We don't have to worry about aerodynamic forces anymore. I want to make sure that Val's in control, actually, so that if we lose connection with the uh, KSC, we're still good to go. Okay, I'm going to turn the throttle all the way off, but I am going to release the stage. So we're in our final stage, and we're going to drift to space and complete our mission. Val, I'm so proud of you. Not concerned for a moment. Oh, I hear that music. I think that means space. 75,000. All right. It's interesting there's no, uh, not showing any new experiments available. I'm sure we haven't done a crew EV report from space. It's 
weird. What's wrong with you, science alert? That. 19 seconds to our apoapsis. Let's tilt. Wait, is that our direction? Hmm. Yeah, let's burn back towards. Oh, I see. My nav ball's all messed up because I chose to control from the uh, from the command seat. Oh well, we'll deal with it. Burn back this way. This is actually going to be super convenient for the uh, sorry the uh, Kerbal Engineer readout up here at the top is going to be super convenient because it shows us our impact biome. We're going to go for something other than grasslands or shore. Impact biomes, uh, impact biome mountains. Not loving that. All right, screw this. We're going back to control by the control from uh, from the probe, so we can actually see where we're going. There we go. I can't handle it. The uh, ninety degree offset control scheme. Okay, we need more thrust because oh, we're out of fuel. All right, we're landing. Oh, perfect. We're landing in the Highlands. Let's point ourselves retrograde and get ready for re-entry. Take it a glamour shot. I think that's the thumbnail. Let's hope it's not the last picture Val ever takes. Another EV airport for us? Oh, we're gonna set, let's, uh, uh oh, no, let's not worry about this right now. Let's worry about staying alive. Oh, actually, there isn't even re-entry at all. Oh, we're still gonna land in the grasslands after all. But we're through the uh, we're through the worrisome part of the descent. We could fire our, uh, we could fire our parachutes now and be just fine. Okay, can we transmit this in and grab a new one? Although we're flying low in grasslands now, I think we probably already have this. I don't have the option for an EVA, EVA report. That's weird. Oh. It's out. Let's say yes off. Let's just fall naturally. And here we go. Falling down in the suburb somewhere. These uh, textures that got added for Kerbin with uh, the visual enhancements pack, they sure look a lot better from uh, space <laughs> than they do from a thousand meters above ground. Val, do you have any words to mark this historic moment? The first purple in space? Ah, oh no, but she gets excited about seeing her booster, booster crash into the ground. Here we are. And... Mission success. not ask for better.
perfect. Recover vessel. 23 science earned. That's how we do it, boys. One launch, one victory. Mission summary for OSD4. We have nearly a quarter of a million Kerbucks. Valentina, ready for next assignment. No experience gain. That surprises me. Ah, yes. And next episode? Ah, there it is. Next episode. We build and fly our first airplane. Accept contract. See you guys later. Thanks for watching.